Hey, you probably can't hear me, but if you can, I just want to let you know that everyone's fine. No one got seriously injured. Well, except for you, of course. You... You did something stupid handling all those villains by yourself. But you saved the students. Oh. I guess you did the right thing. I'm one to talk. All of them asked for you. Even after their checkups, they didn't want to leave without making sure that you would be all right. <laughs> you must be doing something right with those kids. Of the two of us, you're always the one that... <laughs> actually acts like one of them and not like their professor. <sighs> the doctor said you... will wake up soon. And that I should keep talking to you. You know, see if you react. But I honestly don't know what to say. I could keep going on about how much of an idiot you were running into that building. Though, <laughs> a lot of good it would do now. You did the heroic thing. Even if it meant risking your life or not coming out alive... And honestly, I hate that. I hate it because for a moment I really... I really thought you wouldn't make it when I saw you there on the ground. So... So still, it was like you were fast asleep, hardly breathing. Peaceful, in a way. But I knew you... You put yourself at risk for others. <laughs> and I didn't know what to do. I don't know what... <sighs> it's selfish. I know that losing you would be a loss for everyone, but... All I could think about was how it would hurt me if you, if you didn't come back, you know, uh, I don't, I didn't know what to do then and I don't know what I would do now if I didn't have you, so. I guess I realize that I'm not really ready to say goodbye to another friend, much less you. During all these years, I've been so, so close to giving up on heroes, on people, on myself. But you... You saved me. You have been everything to me. And if I lost you too, I'd lose myself right along with you. The truth is, I love you. I love you so much. And I need you. I still need you. I... I don't think I'd be able to say any of that if you were awake. You know I never want to, um... open up. I never like to open up and make myself vulnerable. To anyone. This job, what it does to you, 
I just never understood why would heroes ever want to love someone when in a heartbeat it could all fall to pieces. And trust me, I... <laughs> I wanted so badly not to feel that way. I tried to hide it. Tried to ignore it. I tried everything I could to not acknowledge this feeling in my chest. All of this... All of this pressure. But I can't. And now, knowing I could have lost you without being honest first, I don't think I want to anymore. <laughs> Maybe you're not even listening and I'm just talking to myself here. <laughs> you might not be able to hear anything. It's been a long couple of days. I should... No. Oh. You're... Awake? Hi. Hey. Hey there. Hey, sleepyhead. How are you feeling? You know what? Let me go grab the doctor. They probably want... They... They would probably like to... Hmm. You, uh, you heard, heard all of that? Uh, <clears throat> look, uh, I, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. You don't have to say anything. It was just a small moment of honesty. And, what, what, listen. Your head probably got turned to mush. You can't just say that you feel the same. You're probably still out of it. So, I... Really? Uh, wow. I... Uh, well, I certainly didn't expect all of that. I... Well, I don't know what I expected... I thought you were unconscious, potentially in a coma for an indefinite amount of time, so I just thought you couldn't really hear, let alone, like, comprehend. Uh, whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, don't move so much, you're going to hurt yourself. Let me, let me just finish, just lay there, Okay. I thought I was going to lose you. I thought I would never get the chance to tell you how happy you make me. No, don't laugh. Yes, happy. I thought I wouldn't get to tell you how you light up my day simply by being in it. That's... I'm not really good at this. What I'm trying to say is I don't want to lie to myself anymore. I don't want to pretend. I want to be with you. I want to protect you. And make you at least half as happy as you make me. I don't know how. But I'm going to do it. Because I love you. Well, that is, if that sort of thing interests you. I don't want to assume. Mm. Mm. Uh. Mm. <clears throat> okay. First off, I told you not to move so much. <sighs> See, that same attitude is what got you here in the first place. By the way, don't think that I've forgotten that you just completely ignored my rule about going into fights alone. You and I are going to have a serious talk about that later. Well, no, no, I... I did enjoy... I, I enjoyed the kiss. I'm not trying to change the subject, but you should... 
rest. That way I can get you out of this god-awful place as soon as possible. But don't worry, I'll... I'll stay right here. I promise I won't move an inch. Just rest. Everything's fine now. You've got a ways to go in your recovery. Uh, uh, uh. There will be time for all of that later. You relax. And know that I adore you, my foolish little hero.